Uh, Heartfelt uh, compliment uh, to him. You showing it? No, Miss Dottervelk. <laughs> oh, ah. <sighs> Agnes Crumplebottom, Crumplebottom dust. Hello and welcome back to episode 19 of the 100 Baby Challenge. If you have not seen the previous episodes, I highly suggest going and checking those out first and then coming back here to watch this one. So we have a lot of kids right now. We have four kids, like kid-aged kids. Uh, no teens, no toddlers, four kids and a baby. So we're just going to see how this goes, but let's just go get into this episode. Okay, let's see what's going on. Okay, so Rowan is still here. Okay, love that. Um, everyone's, all the kids are at school, so, like, that's good for us. All right, they are all studying hard. Juniper, are you pregnant? Yes, okay, Juniper is pregnant with Rowan, I think. Oh, the maid's leaving. All right, perfect. You're working out. Juniper, you're pregnant. I mean, sure, go for it, but, like, you're, you're pregnant. You should be getting some sleep right now. But okay, you do what you want to do. Oh, the baby's crying. I guess you can come back up and work again. Work out again. Dana's calling. Yeah, you can call talk to Dana. Sure. PE class. Patrice's PE class gets to run laps. Lots of them to build their stamina and lung capacity. She's mostly through the first lap and she notices a gap in the bleachers. Just the right size with a little rest. Would coach notice if she sat, sat out a few laps? Well, clearly we can see that Juniper is a fan of fitness and healthy lifestyles and stuff. So she's going to keep running because her children Dana. would not be caught hiding under the bleachers. But she just glances around and decides it's too risky. But imagine that cool shade helps her pick up a little speed. Oh, Patrice finishes her lap with a new personal best time. <laughs> oh, look at Patrice go. Oh. Look at her go. <laughs> it's raining so much. What if you go to sleep? <laughs> Who's calling? Kiss and tell. Patrice spent most of recess running around trying to kiss some of the other students. She didn't catch anybody, but the other students were running away. Patrice! What are you doing? Just all of these calls from school. Too young for kissing! Dana's spent some juicy gossip about Jet. Oh, kids are home, kids are home! Maribel has an A. Wade has an A. Casey has a B. And Patrice has a B. <gasps> we can age up some kids. All right, can we get everyone inside, please? All right, let's open, open this. Maribel aged up! So she wants to be a Zen guru. All right. And a child of the islands. Oh, All right. Well, that's a cute outfit. All right. Now, Wade, it's your turn. What's he going to be? Oh, he wants to be a friend of the animals. Oh, and he loves the outdoors. I love that for him. All right. Can you put some candles on there and then go start your homework? Uh -huh. Why do they immediately tell take selfies as soon as they age up? I think it's kind of funny. Are you asleep on the toilet? I swear she's asleep on the toilet. Everyone's asleep except for Maribel. It's kind of a rare occurrence. I love this dress on her. It's so cute. Is that Malcolm Landgrab? Hi, Malcolm. What if we teach him to knit? Let's teach Wade to knit. That's so cute. I, di I didn't tell you to teach that one. Did I tell you to teach Wade how to knit? Why are you going to sleep in your mom's bed? You need to You need to finish your homework. That did that fit in level three? Yeah, you're done with your skill. And then what if you gift some knittables to, some, to someone what if you gift this to to wade and gift that to maribel why not <gasps> when does this baby age up there isn't nothing in the fridge all right juniper you need to cook something it's almost bailey's birthday the baby's gonna age up soon where did you just put that can you can you resume that please or resume your, resume your fruit salad until level five way to go patrice your children need the bathroom juniper come on let's let's take turns let's Let's take turns. Come on, we can do it. We can make we can take turns. All right, everyone is off to school. Work hard, study hard. Hurry up, finish your extra credit. Off to school. What if we invite over a friend for Juniper? What if we invite Thomas over? Maybe we'll hang out with him. Oh look, there he is. What is he wearing? Sir, those shorts are not working for you. Should we have an affair with our maid? Should we have an affair with Derek? Might have to get a maid. I mean, he left, though, so maybe not today. Jay Huntington III has passed away. Poor Jay Huntington III. Thomas, it's time for you to get out of here. And what if we invite over someone else? What if we invite over Daichi? All right, Daichi's on his way over. There he is. Why is he wearing basically the same thing as Thomas? And he is single. Not that that would really affect anything. That's good to know. It's good to know I'm not breaking up a marriage. Why are you leaving? Where'd you go? Daichi, do not go into my backyard. First kiss. 
<gasps> Look at them. Caroline, no, Caroline, I'm a little bit busy over here. Woohoo! Woohoo, Daichi. And then you can go to sleep, Juniper. Oh, well, then you can take care of the baby, and then you can go to- then you can go to sleep. <gasps> the kids are home! The kids are home! The kids are home! Casey has an A! Patrice has an A! Maribel has an A! And Wade has an A! That's four birthdays today! Holy cow! Someone ate my cake. WHY DO YOU KEEP EATING MY CAKE?! Alright, I was gonna say so. let's get them started on their homework, but they don't need to do their homework, because they're all aging up. Alright, Juniper, you better put candles on this. We're gonna start with Patrice. Alright. She's a geek! Alright, so she wants to be a self-care specialist. Okay. Alright, Casey is a perfectionist. Oh, she wants to be a painter! Oh, that'll be perfect. We can have her do painting for her skill. Alright, Wade is outgoing! Oh, that'll be cute. Oh, he's definitely an outgoing fella. Alright, Maribel's gonna be animal enthusiast! Alright! Alright, cute. I love that. Alright, so we're moving out Maribel and Wade. It's time to start a new household with them. So let's give them some money. Alright, and then they are off on their own! Alright, so I went into Cass and gave Juniper another um, everyday look. So that way we can finish her aspiration by showing off our sweater. And then we can ask our daughter what she thinks of it. Show off knitted clothing. Yeah! I need to gift three knittables. So what if we gift one to someone? What if we gift this to Patrice? And then what if we go gift this one to Gilbert? Where is he? All right, we finished that part of our aspiration. All right, Juniper, come back home. Take care of the baby. Who's calling you? Miles Decker's passed away. Not Miles. Oh, the girls are off to school. What if we take Juniper out today? What if we go to Sulani? What if we go to the sandbar in Sulani? Maybe it's time for a little bit of beach R&R time for our Juniper here. How are we supposed to find people to have babies with if there's no one around? Who are you? Oh, they're making out. Ooh, they're married. What if we still go flirt with him? There's no harm in that. Compliment his yoga pants? You who? We want to have a baby with you. Who are you? Kiyoshi, oh, we've already had his baby. Who are you? You're an elder. That's not going to work. Who are you? You're a kid. Where is everyone? What if we go somewhere else? Mount Komarebi. What if we take it to the bathhouse? Why isn't there anyone here? Go somewhere else. Maybe we'll go to Henford on Bagley. We can find a farmhand to have a baby with. Because why not? Seems like a good plan to me. You're in your- Why are you- uh, Kellen's here. Kenshi? Dylan? You're in your bathing suit? Let's see. Any eligible bachelors? What if the grocery boy is around? Gilbert? No. I'm on a manhunt. <gasps> Is that a man? Taku! Taku? I don't know, but we're gonna give him an enchanting introduction. Ahmed? Ahmed Bean? We'll do, give him a flirty introduction, too. <gasps> oh no, Thomas is here. That might not be good for us. Alright. Uh, ask him if he's single. Pick up line. Heartfelt compliment. Sweet talk him. Who are you? Ah, oh, that's Gilbert. We could attempt wow. to seduce him. <laughs> that could be good. <laughs> Ooh, he's liking us. Heartfelt compliment to him. <laughs> Agnes Crumplebottom Crumplebottomed us! Excuse me, let me flirt with him. Oh, the kids are back. Our kids are home. We need to leave. Juniper, let's go home. A's. Oh, they're both A students. We can move them out. Patrice aged up. Oh, she's childish. Okay. Casey aged up. She's going to be a romantic. Oh, I love that. All right. Let's move them in with their siblings. And that leaves literally just Juniper and a baby. All right. Well, it's just Juniper and the baby. Oh, wait. Come add birthday candles first. Juniper, you need to add birthday candles to this cake. This is the second time it's just been Juniper and a baby. In the bathroom. Thomas wants to ask us out on a date. 
Yeah. We're gonna go into Thomas. Why not? Why not? Okay, Juniper, we need to get to the bathroom before you can do any date things. Leo Schultz, what if we go enchanting introduction to him? Don't tell our date. <gasps> He's single. Lucas Munch! This enchanting introduction to everyone, you know? Alexander Goth! We're introducing ourselves to him, too. We're gonna have a god baby. What if we uh, make a move on Thomas? <gasps> Oops. Can I do a smooth recovery? I guess this is goodbye. Um, don't call me ever. <gasps> smooth apology, Juniper. We need to have his baby. Try to cheer him up and then we need to go home. Yeah, all right. All right, we should go home. Juniper's hungry. Bailey's home from daycare. Juniper, you need to use the bathroom and then get some leftovers. And then Bailey's gonna age up any time now. And then Juniper's gonna give birth soon, too. I just don't know when. <gasps> Bailey's age up! Ah, I have salad stuck in my hand. All right, what's Bailey gonna be? Bossy! Oh my goodness, look at her. Look at her. Adorable. All right. Let's get you talking with Blarfy. Do you hear that thunder? Oh my gosh. That's quite some thunder. Communication level three. I'm just knit until either Bailey wakes up or till she gives birth. Seems like a pretty good. <gasps> Juniper's in labor. She didn't even finish her mailbox cozy. Let's go have a baby. Ah, baby in hospital. What do you think it's gonna be? How many do you think it's gonna be? I'm hoping for at least twins. I'm really kind of hoping it's triplets. Is that weird? I just want- I want more kids. I want more kids. We only have two. We only have Juniper and the baby. <gasps> a baby boy! What's, he, what's his name gonna be? Shane. Have we got a Shane? I like Shane. <gasps> a baby girl! A baby girl. So let's do Shane. Maybe another S name. Sienna. Sienna's cute. <gasps> Twins! Shane and Sienna! And then Juniper. We're calling over someone. I think we're calling over Thomas. Uh -huh. What if we wait over Daichi? Let's go talk with him for a little bit. Invite him in. Um, and then compliment his appearance. And then, like, can we come try for baby? Does he not want like to? Nobby's the babies head. are screaming! <laughs> try for baby with Daichi in the shower. Mario. Excuse me. Why doesn't he want to hoo-hoo with me? I don't know why it won't work. Let's, let's invite someone else over, maybe. Let's try inviting Thomas over. Daichi's leaving! Thomas is on his way over. There's Thomas. Excuse me! Smooth recovery. No one will woohoo with me! Attempt to seduce. Dana, now is not the time! Not the babies! Alright, so no one wants us to have a baby with Juniper right now. Well, I guess we'll try next episode. So I think we'll, I th I think we'll end it here. And we'll try to have a baby with someone next episode because no one apparently wants to have a baby with Juniper today. And I'm a little offended by that, but it's fine. It's, it's fine. We'll just come back next week and try it again. So thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. It really helps out my videos if you do that. Plus leave comments of suggested baby names if you want to. I would love, love, love to see them. Also, if you didn't know, I stream on Twitch. I stream Monday through Friday at 10 a.m. and 7 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. If you want to join us, we have a whole lot of fun things planned for Halloween. So be sure to check it out. It's my Twitch channel linked down below, as is my Discord and other social medias if you want to follow me on there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next week. Bye!